Hello again, everyone. Welcome back. Well, I'm here with Osgener Family Cigars and their new cigar, the Pie Synesthesia Red. And this is a Toro 6x52. Red, red. There's your density. Has a nice feel in the hand. Now this cigar uses an Ecuadorian Sumatra wrapper over a Nicaraguan binder and fillers from Nicaragua. Tim Osgener, founder of Osgener Family Cigars, wants these, this cigar to taste like the color red. For example, spices or peppery things. We'll see. The pie synesthesia is part of the name, uh, the part of the name that references an art series created by the late Kano Osgener, the father of Tim Osgener, founder of CAO Cigars. A lot of you will remember Kano Osgener. He was the original CAO. So let's get right to it. The new Pi Synesthesia Red. All right, one of these with the uh, red ribbon at the foot, and usually the ones I've had, I've had to circle around and work its way off, and I, that's what we'll do. Good draw. Very good, actually. No problem there. Sort of a citrus, light apricot, a little more citrus than apricot, but you get them both. A little bit of a cockeyed percentages, a light brown sugar, and then uh, a, a leathery uh, black coffee. Black pepper, about seven and a half. Nothing red to me in the initial light up. Maybe I missed something, but I don't think so. So, it's not a bad start. It's not mind-blowing, but let's see what we have in the first third. First third. There's a little bit of a apricot citrus note and a little brown sugar, quite a bit of earthy, leathery black coffee. And it's, again, nothing red comes to mind. Finishes leather, and good lingering black pepper. Medium body. <clears throat> the notes that are sweet are a little on the lower side. There's quite a bit of the earthy, leathery black coffee. Much more of it than the sweet notes. And uh, the cigar is just is just uh, not in, in uh, something that's wowing me. It. it, it it's not at all like what I, what it was billed as. I rate the first third 90. It's, I mean, it's okay. It's just not something that's like stands out. And I'm surprised at that. I really am. And maybe things will change, but the first third was just 90.
in the second third, and this cigar perplexes me. I'm not getting anything that reminds me of red, and it, the flavors are just kind of so-so. There's a little apricot, sort of a citrus peel type note, almost a little bitterness of citrus peel. Very light brown sugar, a whole lot of earthiness, and a whole lot of leathery black coffee. Medium bodied. Finishes. Leather. Very good lingering white pepper. It, it, I mean, the cigar is not bad. It's just nothing stands out about it. Uh, the flavors are okay. I, I, it's just, I don't know. I'm perplexed as to what they were going for, but uh, I don't get anything red. That is supposed to be the theme. It's supposed to be everything about red. I don't get red. The second, third, I would rate 87. It's just, you know, it's okay. It's, it's not anything just outstanding. And I want it to develop some outstanding flavors. So, Let's see if we have them in the final third. Down to the end, so let's wrap it up. I guess you could say it improved a little bit. There's more brown sugar now. You don't really get really a whole lot of anything else. There's a, a, a light hint of apricot or citrus peel, some sort of a citrus type note. A lot of earthiness, a lot of leathery black coffee. Medium body. Finishes unchanged. The brown sugar helped it. I mean, you have some sweetness now. I'll go 89 for the final third. But this uh, cigar just totally perplexes me as far as the theme, which is red and everything red. I don't get red. But be that as it may, your overall score is 88.67. So... Take that with a grain of salt. Give it a try. Let me know what you think and tell me why it is red. So there you have it. The new pie synthesthesia red. 88.67.